Hey guys, Fishmonger here. I kind of have some sad news. I am going to be taking a little break, I think, uh, from some of these videos for a little bit. Um, but I have a very special guest who will be uh, taking my place. Um, you, you might have met him before. He's actually a pretty famous guy. Uh, he just doesn't really get any screen time um, or make any YouTube videos as of right now. But he, uh, he soon will be. So... Uh, without uh, further ado, let me introduce you to my esteemed colleague, Fish Miner. Hey guys, Fish Miner here. I gotta say, uh, first off, it's a pleasure being here on the uh, Fishmonger channel. Um, such a lovely place. I, I gotta say thank you. Well, it's a pleasure having you here. Um, I'm sure everybody's going to uh, get to appreciate uh, talking to you and listening to what you have to say. Yeah, I'm going to be talking a lot about uh, Bitcoin mining. Pretty much, instead of talking about Fishmonger, the Warcraft fishing bot, we're going to try to branch off more into just uh, Bitcoin mining. Uh, me being here unexpectedly isn't a problem, is it? Not a problem, not a problem. Uh, thank you, man, thank you. I, d I do appreciate uh, you coming in here and stepping in, and um, hopefully, uh, you know, Fish Miner, you'll be a hit. Uh, it's all good. Hopefully I will be, man. Thanks again. That sounds great, man. Appreciate it. Hey, that was fun. Um, man, chroma keying is not as easy as it uh, seems to be. I uh, had a green screen, and then a green screen blended into a green screen, another green screen, and before you knew it, I was disappearing myself all over the video, so it was quite interesting. Anyway, fish miner... I said fish miner, not monger. Hello? There we go, thank you. Fish miner here, and um, it's still the same channel. I just felt like fucking around. Um, but the only thing I really got to say right now about stuff is that I, I really am going to be taking a break uh, for some videos for a little bit. I got a lot of stuff that uh, is going on, um, and my house is going to be in disarray for quite some time. So probably in about two or three weeks, I shall be back uh, and improved uh, once I get uh, some things kind of straightened up. Um, I did get um, a new card for my Bahama Mama mining rig, though. Um, and actually, what's cool is I'm now up to 14 GPUs in this. This was the this is the B250 Mining Expert um, that normally is a well, it can hold up to 19 GPUs, um, and you can put 13 in it, uh, you know, Nvidia and AMD and all that good stuff. Um, but you can actually go up to 19 if you get those special mining cards, the P106s or P104s. And it just so happens, if you can see here from the screen, slot number one or ID number one is a P106 card. I picked one up. I got one on uh, Mercari. It's a website that I've never really heard of before. Somebody at my work told me about it. And it had some pretty neat stuff on there. And I picked up one of these cards for like 200 bucks. Uh, six gigabyte P106. So it's essentially like a GT, uh, GTX 1060 uh, for um, you know, 200 bucks. It's not a bad price for a six gigabyte card. Um, it's a card that doesn't have any fans on it. It's got a heat sink on it, but no fans. So it's obviously meant to be uh, installed inside of a server. So right now it's literally just sitting on top of my mining rig because all the fans are there blowing up. So I figured I would just kind of use that for some of the cooling. Um, and you can see it's, um, it's actually this card right here. It says GPU four. It's not GPU four. Um, but this is that card. Uh, it's because I my my rig is mining uh, two different algorithms right now, so these are all kind of mixed up. But basically, it's the hottest card, which is at 66 degrees Celsius, uh, which makes sense because it's got the worst cooling because it technically has like no fans on it right now. But 66 just for getting ambient air cooling from uh, my rig is really not that bad. Um, hashing away, it's doing um, Ethereum at 24.9 uh, mega hash right now, so it's a pretty pretty quick card. I mean, I got it running at uh, what is it, uh, 75 watts. And I got the memory at um, only 1,200 right now, actually, is where this thing is at. No, I'm sorry, it's 1,400. It's this card right here. Um, so I got the, the memory clocked up to 1,400. So um, I'm pretty happy with it. Um, if I could find some more of these cards at a pretty cheap price, I'll happily stick them in the rig and just keep building this rig up. Uh, because, again, one of the nice things about having a motherboard that can handle, like, 19 GPUs is every time I want to add more and more cards to my rig, I don't have to worry about spending more money on more RAM or CPUs or any more other components other than 
getting another riser, plugging it in, and hooking it up to one of my server power supplies and calling it a day. Um, you know, the, the biggest issue I have right now is just the fact that I've got all these cards on here, and it doesn't tell me my, my wattage. It's probably like 1,300 watts right now. I'm kind of pushing the limit of uh, one of my single plugs in the wall, so I might actually have to split this off into a couple different plugs just to be safe. I don't run it. I don't like running too many amperage, uh, too much amperage through one cord, especially if there's no reason to. Um, but I'll be going into more detail on this. I do have some people who are asking about some other videos um, in Hive, which is what I'm running right now, basically saying things like, how do you set up uh, the dual mining and your wallets and all that good stuff, and uh, if I can find the time, I will I will totally make those videos. It's just going to be... Uh, I'm a little swamped right now. I'm going to be swamped for quite some time. Um, so I, until next time, I will catch you on the flip side. This is Fish Miner signing out.